Ladies and gentlemen, I am Yisrael, the game is Star Trek Online, and welcome once again to Foundry Frolics, where despite my science officer's ravings about something called the Galactic Ley Line, we are in fact going to head out to the Rato system this week for, well, let's go for part two of the Raptor Star. We've secured the Raptor system, we did this in a previous episode. We have the primary starbase secured. And now it's time for the ground assault. Please tell me we get giant walkers for this one. Would that be too much to hope for? Yes, probably because the assets don't exist. Beam down the boarding parties. It's time to continue the attack upon Rator 3. And welcome back to the Starbase, which we pretty much fragged out the last time we were here. But Admiral Kirkrek, tell me we have something to work with here. Jolantro indeed. Right, so, do we have any questions? Hey, what's the plan for the assault? Well, the usual. First we secure the area around the perimeter, then we need to drop the defense shield, and off we go. Kiryov. Actually, no. Kiryov would be nearer to a Commodore than an Admiral, and I'm going the wrong way. Which really doesn't help matters. Excuse me, guys. Coming through. Excuse me. Don't mind me. There we are. This way. And I should probably dress for the occasion as well. Running around in the shoot me shoulders really doesn't help matters very much. So, Commando Gear. He has a... Yes, we know you have a bad feeling about this. You don't need to tell us three or four times. Right. Okay. So, can we activate this force field? Yes, apparently we can. Activates the force field. Yoink. Well, they're not getting in that way. Now, what do we need? Check with the operations, commanders. There we are. Uh, there could be trouble. There's always trouble. Call for backup just in case. Hey, guys. Determine the cause of the strange readings. Scans the cargo. It's a bomb. It's always a bomb. Really? <laughs> okay, fine. Well, we can go for extermination when we might just have to. Apparently, so can they. Wow, that's a lot of... Well, strictly speaking, they're the... Um, ow! Wee, ow, 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 ow. That was a bit of a dirty trick to pull. Right, back we go, guys. And let's pull out the shotgun. We will not be taken by surprise this time. All right, report to Admiral Kirkrek. So we don't actually have to... Um, wait, was that intended to be unwinnable? Deactivate the force field. Let us back in. We have some drones to purge. And we'll start with you. Okay. Is he dead yet? Oh, okay, right, you're not meant to be able to beat those guys, are you? Right, do a little respawning, and let's just talk to the Admiral before we get completely overrun. Yes, it's regrettable. Understood. Um, check the war map. Fine, so we've got a big blue splodge on the right, a big red splodge on the left, and a little green splodge in the middle. We're all going to die. All right, that's my analysis done. Terrific. Yes, we're ready for battle. Sir, we appear to be under attack. I don't know if you've noticed. Excellent. Let's get back into space. At least I can kill those guys. Um, Space? Ah, there we are. Space. Space. There we are. Go to the next map. Excellent. Do it. Do it now, before we get sucked into the two-dimensional black hole. And, ooh, looky, Romulans! Um, well, no, I'm not going to do either of those to begin with. I'm going to start by shooting Romulans, because that's always a good start. Get the tractor beam out, get the depth charges away, and... You're like, oh, really? You want to play with viruses, do you? Two can play that game. Also, launch fighters. Okay, orbs to repairs, there we go, and switch to broadsides, 
roll around to the front and am I going to get the angle with the phaser lance? No, and besides it was a waste anyway. Evasive maneuvers, get out of there because Romulan ship go bang. Then hard round and you, however, you can have an Enterprise Special. Come on, up we go, just close the range down a bit. Dump the cloaking device and fire the lance! Colossal overkill, but funny anyway. Yes, I am aware that I just commented that I wasn't going to waste shots and then fired one on a Mogai that was nearly dead. So sue me. Okay, how are we doing? Pretty decently so far. The Dodex has taken a few hits. We've lost the fighters, so get another wave of disposable drones out there. I'm assuming that's, that's the explanation. I mean, you don't really think we're putting live pilots in those flying coffins, do you? Where's me overload? All right, must have used it when we knocked down that starboard shield. Eh, yeah. more Talshar babes gone wild. You guys have really got to stop opening those emails. And there we go. Boom, 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 boom. Right. Emergency power to weapons. Get the overload on the go. Reinforce the shields. Has the meters away. And orcs to structural once again to patch up. Beam overload fires. Crunches through most of his port shield. And then he gets the happy, happy joy that is a dual beam bank. And um, overload's just about to come back. Well, that's unfortunate. Seriously, guys, stop opening the emails. I don't care what they promise you about a wild session of Pond Fire, it's not going to happen. And besides, I thought they pretty much eliminated that when they monkeyed with the genome back in the ruling Queen's time. Right, anyhow, we appear to have run out of enemy fleet. That's handy. I suppose we'd better double check the survivors. Um, and by double check, I do, of course, mean loot dry. There we go. So check for survivors first. And nope. Oops. Oh, well, and we didn't even get to salvage the ship either. And the Pontix. Oh, there you are. Destroy these troops. Yes, get ready to die, scum. Beam to the staging area and begin, well, begin landing your troops, General. Well, it's a, we're going to take a city with this. It's a very small army you've beamed down. Then again, I suppose we have got a lot of fire support, mostly up in orbit. Ah, the Tal Preex, the Watchers of the Praetor. Um... Yes. I'm, look, I'm sure the arm's working fine. Just give it a couple of squirts of WD-40 if you have to. Right, so let's check in with the Talpreex first of all. Okay, uh, who's on top of your chain of command? Their IRF commandos and Levintius is asking. And the other soldier? He's 5 or 7. Okay, great. Glad you're on our side. Please be actually on our side and not another damn one of Sailor's sleeper agents. Welcome to the front lines, and the transports wouldn't be able to take the pilot. Yeah, we're just doing our duty, honest. And okay. And surprise, surprise, the enemy knew about the weak spot in the flank. Lucky us. Sniper rifle out. And ooh, what do you know? Explosives. And a lot of commandos who just need to be quickly patched up. There you go. Right as rain. And. Hey guys, shoot the medic first. Standard rules. Apparently there used to be some charming thing called the Geneva Convention, which barred doing stunts like that. Ow, apparently the Romulans have heard of it as well. Sodding hell. Respawn. Right then, this time we are going to lurk around the back and focus our fire on one at a time. There we go. And then find the next victim. There you are. And the next. And the next. And are they all dead yet? More or less, but we have Romulans coming around the flank. Well, we had Romulans coming around the flank. Now we have Romulans littering the perimeter. So untidy. 
At least their starships dispose of themselves when you wreck them. Come on, down you go. Thank you. Yoink. And zappy, zappy, zappy. Done. Okay, next. Right, switch to shotgun since he's getting a bit close. And then we just need to finish off a lot of basic Romulan troopers. Yow, yow, yowza, yowza, yowza. Okay, bring forth Ensign Rock. If they won't listen to fire, perhaps they'll listen to Earth. And a solid dose of polytrinic acid, but that's besides the point. There we go. Run in again, shotgun a few more. Oh, what do you know? Fireworks after all. Right, just got a couple left to take care of. They're over here, and oh, there's a sub lieutenant. So, tippy toes, tippy toes, tippy toes. Hey guys, you're a little late to the party. I don't know if anyone told you. Shoot the medic first. Many times. There we go. Then on to the Centurion, who has obligingly exposed himself. And yes, he just got vaporized with a bullet. Because Mako rifles are just that damn awesome. Sorry, TR-116s, they're used by Makos, but officially they're not the Mako battle rifle. Because the Corps of Engineers couldn't make up their mind on the proper name. Right, where next? And, well, you're lucky. And there are... Oh, right. So, um, yes, ma'am. I'm not even going to ask about the date round here. That may very well get me stabbed. Completely accidentally. In the back. 32 times. Total accident. Utter tragedy. These things happen to unwanted boyfriends in Romulan culture. Anyhow, next problem is getting the AA turrets online. Come on, please tell me there is a big green button here. Oh, wait, no, it's a Roman control panel. They're all green buttons. Oh, damn it. There we go. That's one. And two. Poke, poke, prod, poke, beep. And shoot down the incoming fighters. Uh, what incoming fighters? Uh, okay, how do we do this? There we go. Fire the turrets. Well, I, well, there's what's left of the fighters. Hey guys, we dealt with the very quick and invisible fighter. Well, maybe we dealt with the very quick and invisible fighters. We're not sure. There are still bombs going off. Don't suppose you know anything about that? Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. Right, Dio, there we are. Okay, the power generator has... Oh dear, I'll go fix the generator because I'm really not... Hang around to be shot by another wave of Tal Shiar. It's an entirely disagreeable experience. Mind you, then, so was getting all transcendental in another universe. But hey, that was just an accident with a prototype drive. Eh, okay, generator's over here. Please tell me it's not about to explode. Fire. Fire. Fire, Bernie, 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 hot, 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 ow, 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 and no more Bernie. Excellent. Now fix generator. Crank, poke, prod, done. Oh, wait, no, another generator to fix. Over here. Kick, poke, prod, swear, clutch, broken toes. And the big guns are, oh dear. Right, so it's going to be defeating the final assault on the base. Um, apparently there were a lot of people in those crashed fighters. They were fighters, weren't they? I mean, someone's going to be really upset if we wiped out a whole squadron worth of civilian freight liners. And oh my word, that's a lot of Romulans. And I don't think any of them are happy to see us. So let's just see if the group splits up a bit. Maybe. Ah, there we go. Handy, handy, handy. Yoink. It's only a... In the back, it's only a pity they were awake. Okay, just... Just get the heals going. No, I wanted to heal Lyasara. Thank you. 
And just keep the weapons fire coming. Dooby 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 doo. Ooh, shiny! Promotion. Also, Bernie, Bernie, Bernie. Hot, hot, hot. Ow, ow, ow. Stop, Bernie. And you know what? Let's just close up and go for the shotgun before his mates get back. Um, die now. Come on. Thank you so much. Kindly die. Now we'll just back up a bit, wait for the next wave to walk away. And in the back. Whoops. Nope. Missed. Okay. Fine by me. We'll just close up again. Come on. Round you come. One. And... No. Pity. Okay. Loot the place dry instead. Polon Blast Assault. Yeah, well, it'll be good for cash if nothing else. And a small power cell. Okay. Wait for Wave 2 to come back. It's really not much of an assault. It's more like they're out for a gentle Sunday stroll. But such are the limits of the par thing. Okay, and I think the group is getting strung out, so we'll back it up. And then we'll just carefully take aim and shoot a Romulan in the back. And then shoot him a few more times, just to make sure that he stays dead. Okay. Remembering to kill the medics first. I said kill the medics first, damn it. Right, unleash the Horta. And also the triage. And then we'll see how well they deal with earth and fire. I'm not sure I'm going to make much use of air and water for this one, but... Never mind. We may only have two, but with their powers combined, we are going to kill lots of Romulans, which I'm pretty sure wasn't in the original script. Hey, what can I say? We come in peace, and the enemy are leaving in pieces. Anyhow, here comes the final wave. We'll just start with... Um, the medic. I said we'll start with the medic. Okay, fine. We won't be starting with the medic at all. I need a clear shot on said medic, if you don't mind. Or I can just keep plugging away. Right, bring it in. Bring in the guys and the backup and the triage. And pop out Ziborg Nanites as well. Emergency shield. Oh, bollocks. Dead. Right. Respawny. For those of you wondering about this, A, it's part of the I suck at ground combat, and the Renegade's attack failed. What's the big prize? The capital city. Lovely. Well, if you don't mind, I um, kind of need to sort out a small Romulan problem that we've got over here. It's just one of those little things, you know, distractions, minor injuries, disruptor fire, corpses littering the base. Come on, drop dead. Oops, and now we're dead again. And no, I haven't even got this set to hard action yet. I have a feeling it was rebalanced for the old, somewhat wussier Romulans, which tells you how old this mission is. However, kill the medic first, because that's what we should have done a long time ago. And then ensure that... Well, you kindly die. Thank you. Now we'll switch out. Shotgun a couple of Ulans to death. Heal up again. Get a tricorder in. Oh, missed the expose on the Ulan, but doesn't much matter. Duck for a bit. Roll away because that is a failure on Seeker Drone. And if it gets to me, it gets very awkward very quickly. Heal up again. And then just plug this guy full of lead until he falls over. Do we even still use lead for bullets in these things? I'm not actually sure. Right, so, now that we've solved our little Romulan problem, what were you saying about the old mining shaft? What point? Where are you? Hmm. Okay, ops. There we go. Right, sorry, you were saying. So we've got the Momentum, Capital City, and the Fleet Liaison Officer. Okay. Okay, the old mining shaft, then what? And we're going to... Yeah, Roger, of course, and they're going to realise we're there. Of course they're going to realise we're there. Then we switch off the defence shield and then profit. 
Okay, roger that. Um, I thought you were supposed to be sending in a small team, not a load of heavily armed lead for... Oh, uh, uh, wait, no, the commando team probably said the same thing about us. Right, off we go to the old mining cave. Ignoring the fact that there are, you know, still Romulans about. Oh, wait, you're what? We could have just... Excuse me. <sighs> certain words are going to have to be exchanged with the designers of these guns. Also, certain bullets. They did tell us there was enough juice in the guns for one shot, in fairness. I, I probably should have worked it out, but no, had to do it the hard way. Yep, I can be an idiot at times. Right then. What next? Enter the cave. Well, that's fine. The cave won't turn out to be landmines stuffed full of unhappy wildlife or Tal Shiar soldiers or even all three of the above. I mean, how could this possibly go wrong? Ah, that's how. It's the end of the mission. That has been part two of the Raptor Star. One of the older Foundry missions probably needs a balance pass purely because the Romulans got a major, major boost to their ground combat a few years back which tells you rather how old this mission has got to be, but all in all, not too shabby at all. Ladies and gentlemen, I have been Yusril, the game has been Star Trek Online, that has been Foundry Frolics, like and subscribe if you want more of this nonsense, and until next time, farewell.